Hey, beautiful souls. I'm Brooke. I am an intuitive Reiki master. I'm also a channel for the divine. Welcome back. Let's see who's going next. Capricorn. I <laughs> love it. Look how beautiful these cards are. All right, Capricorn's going next. Let's see what's going on with Capricorn this week. Let's see what's going on with Capricorn this week. As I'm shuffling, let's call in Archangel Michael. Ask him to wrap his protection around me and around you. Let's ask Metatron to activate his cube and cleanse any chakras that may need to be cleansed at this time. Okay, one more please. Let's see what's going on with Capricorn. You and your loved ones are safe. New moon in Cancer, 53. Emotions are running high. I feel this. <laughs> Have faith in your dreams. Aww. Yeah, you're definitely being reminded to, you know, observe. Don't absorb the emotions, especially if they're negative. Okay? And then what's holding this up, be bold and make the first move. And communication is key. There it is again. Show the world the real you. So, throat chakra, third eye chakra. There's definitely a lot that needs to, um, to be said is what it feels like. There's a lot that needs to be said. Keep in mind, um, emotions are running high. Really keep a check on your emotions. Try not to react. Observe. Do not absorb. Okay. Have faith in your dreams. Use, you know, be bold and make the first move. 212. Let's see what's going on. There's some resistance in the energy. Cracked open. Okay. Could be going through a dark night of the soul. Could be having a heart chakra awakening. Learning to be human in the world, but not of it. Yep. Definitely feels like going through dark night of the soul. Two wanted to come out. I get called, sold gifts, training. It's time to step up. Okay. So you're definitely in hermit mode. Trust the timing. Have faith in your dreams. Really getting ready to go through this portal. Energy, especially with the 33 on my clock. Especially with the eclipses coming up. Okay. What's holding this up, breath of the cosmos, my will to thy will, micromanaging the universe. Let go, let God lead. Okay? Let go and let God lead. Really, allow for the emotions to come up that needs to come up, especially while you are going through this dark night of the soul, 3.33 on my clock, while you're going through this heart chakra purge. There's definitely something going on there. Um, something new's coming in, okay? So as you release this, getting ready for the eclipses, it's going to be coming up in tour season. Trust the timing and have faith in your dreams. Trust the timing. Okay, one more. Let's see what's going on with past lives. Okay, release any, any left out in the cold feelings, release abandonment, release rejection, release um, not feeling loved or not wanted. Need to release that. Um, you could be adopted. You could be adopting, okay? <laughs> We're being reminded 444 to really tap into God, tap into our higher self, okay? Age of Pisces, moving into the age of Aquarius. Now what's holding this up is going to be the Knights. 
grounding energy, really grounding that energy, okay? You're not trusting and you're not having faith in your dreams when that's going to be the most important thing that you could do right now is really have faith in your dreams. Have faith that you're going in the direction that you're meant to be going in. Practice self-love during the dark night of the soul. We have to go to the dark in order to get to the light. It's part of the process. Literally. Let's see where we're at on the journey. Journey by moonlight. Believe in the magic, right? You've got to really work on those lower vibrational energies that's holding you in place. Um, the inner child journey, really, you know, self-worth, self-value. Clearing the past to heal the present. Yes. Goes back to what I said. The answers are within. <laughs> yes, they are. Joy and delight. Open your heart to joy. And then answering the call. Okay. I hear the trumpets. Do you hear the trumpets? What is that call? Okay, we've got the portals coming up with the eclipses. It's going to be a lot changed during that time. You know, eclipses clip things out. Literally. Sometimes it's hard to watch. Okay, one more, please. There's some resistance in the energy. I'm not really... Getting it to move. <laughs> Believe in yourself. Yes. Mm -hmm. Believe in you. Trust the great mystery. It's 11 card. Yes. I actually got two 11s. Oh, and then another 11. 11, 11, 11. Okay. Transformation is beautiful. And then what's holding this up is 10, was spirit. Sometimes life stings. Okay. And that really represents the, the, um, Heart chakra purge that's happening right now could be a dark night of the soul. It feels painful, but it really is for your greatest good and highest joy because the abundant universe is going to provide. Make your dreams real. Another 11. Make your dreams real. All right, Capricorn, if this reading resonates with you and you'd like for me to dive in deeper, my website's below. I'd love to sit down with you and um, see where you're at in the journey. I hope you have a magical root chakra day and I'll see you soon. Bye.